Richard Armitage stars once again as Thorin Oakenshield, the king of the dwarves. It is, ha it is great to have you here. Congratulations. Uh, wow, what an opening. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Uh, it's always a bit of a shock when you see the, the feed to see how, how, uh, how little we are on the screen. Well, but, uh, and, and that's the amazing thing about you. What, you're six foot three. Uh, I am, yes. And you play this hairy dwarf. Yeah. And you've also played uh, Macbeth, Hamlet. I got to know, is, is being a dwarf a lot tougher? For a guy like you? In this instance, yeah, definitely. I think the weight of the costume um, was was extremely uh, difficult to, to work with. But um, I don't know. He wanted us to look like warriors, so um, they made us bigger versions of ourselves so that when the computer makes us smaller, we don't look like children. So. And I am blown away by, of course, the digital effects, but the prosthetics are pretty incredible, too. This nose that they did for you actually helped save your real nose in a battle scene from your own sword, I read? Yeah, it's actually a nose, a forehead, and a, and a whole kind of uh, latex head. But yeah, um, during the first film, I managed to smack myself in the face with a, a shield. And on this second film, uh, it was awkward. I, I kind of caught myself between the eyes. So uh, it was the silicon that saved me. From so getting, yeah, were it not yeah. for this mask type thing you had on your yeah. face, but the, the, you look uh, much different right now. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> the doctor came over and was like, we really need to stitch this because there was a huge kind of split in the head, but he didn't realize I was wearing a, a prosthetic, which, is, which was good. Well, I think your fans were all very happy that everything worked out yeah. okay.